What's up everybody, my name is Vince. Welcome to the channel. Today's video, we have a cool little accessory from DeWalt. It seems like Stanley Black & Decker and or DeWalt have an accessory for almost everything out there. One of my favorites you can find right over here. Pretty awesome, and you loved it as well. I know you don't know about it, but you, you know. So here's the deal. A lot of you say that impact drivers are not made for drilling. And the wall said, hey, we have an accessory so that you don't need to drill with your impact driver anymore. It's a very robust solution. We're gonna share it with you right after this message from our sponsor, VCG Construction. Here it is. This is DeWalt's Impact Ready half inch to quarter inch adapter. So, for a lot of you that say you're not supposed to drill with an impact driver, now you can take your adapter, put it on your half inch impact wrench, and you're able to load anything with a quarter inch hex. This is awesome. It's product number DW2298. Let's get it unboxed. I wanna see what we can shove in there. It's pretty funny. This adapter is made for ball detent. It will work with a hog ring. Slides right on. And now you've got yourself quarter inch collet. Some of you are thinking like, why not just use your impact driver? You know, I, you know, I don't know. Maybe some people don't have an impact driver. Maybe they have an impact wrench. This is just an adapter. Instead of going out and buying a separate tool, you get more function. It might not make 100% sense for everyone, but for that person that needs to turn their impact wrench into something that could drive a quarter inch shanked bit, maybe it does make sense. I know what you're probably thinking. This adapter is gonna add all this undue weight to the combination, you know? So this impact wrench weighs eight pounds, 10.1 ounces. I mean, this is all metal. It's impact rated. This adds an additional, look at it. It brings all up eight pounds, 13.4 ounces, 0.5 ounces. You're probably thinking to yourself, we now have opened Pandora's box. There are so many bits that we can use with this impact wrench. For instance, we can run number two screws. And what's great about this is it's quick insert. Look at that and watch. No, no dice. Wow, something different here. I've never really seen before. If you look in there, there's no ball detent for retention. There's an actual bar that runs across. That's what holds on. I mean, I guess it's so much torque. Reality is, when you're driving longer fasteners, it's all about the torque, not necessarily about the speed. Let's put our impact wrench on speed one. We didn't even get an impact out of it. Let's go speed two. Oh, we did get it in two. It's not, see? A lot of torque, a lot of torque. Let's put it on speed three. Wow, I think the other, it was the screw. It was the screw, not the impact. I'm gonna do one more in speed two. Something to be said about the amount of torque. Crazy, pretty awesome. I, I kind of was like, nah, this is ridiculous. But look at that, no problem at all driving that screw. Here's the deal, I know what you're thinking, like, we have a cobalt impact wrench, a DeWalt adapter. And we're gonna use ah, Milwaukee Red Helix bits. Yeah, why not? See how quickly we could drill a half inch hole, put it in speed three. We'll see how this works out. <laughs> oh, no. I think bull detent would have worked better. So the collet didn't let go, but the, the hog ring did. I gotta tell you, let's, let's step it up. Effortless. We got the max speed from Irwin over here. Let's see how it does drilling a hole with one of these. I mean, there's no stopping it. 
except for backing out, <laughs> backing out the pit. There we go. It completed all the tasks. Let me know down in the comments section, what do you think this adapter would be best suited for? Is it a solution looking for a problem? Or did you just think to yourself after watching this, wow, I need one of those. If you're that person, make sure you smash the like button. If you're not that person, make sure you smash the like button. Leave the comment down below. Is this useless or do you love it? Is this gonna solve your problems? We wanna know. With that, I wanna say I appreciate each and every one of you for being here. Thanks a lot, everybody. We'll see you all on the next one. Video's over, but I know you want more. So this is how you're gonna get it. First thing you need to do is pretend you're this guy. And you're here at the birthplace of freedom. Now ring that bell like it's 1776 and let all notifications throw. What? You're not subscribed yet? Well, smash this button here. After that, watch this video here, here, and maybe over here. See you later.